All right, go ahead. No more hacking the coffin here. All right. We'll blame it on B over there. That wood oven throwing off some smoke this morning. But uh, hey, this afternoon, hey, we're doing the uh, Kentucky Hot Brown. Okay, so look at this nice bacon. So we're gonna broil. We're gonna broil up some bacon. And uh, B gave me four slices. But hell, you know. But I guess if we got it, we're gonna use it. B, I guess B wants to test. She wants to be test pilot on this one today. All right, so I'm gonna put under the broiler. Um, and then, um, so essentially it's turkey. I got nice. You can use whatever uh, bread you want. I got some nice onion rolls from uh, Stop and Shop. And. Uh, so I give three nice slices, and uh, I'm gonna brown this off. Get that bacon browned off, and uh, it also calls for some tomato. So here for a tomato, we've never seen it before. Put your tip in there, so you don't cut your finger, like I've done a few times, and. Uh, So what we do is let, let that bread brown up, let that bacon cook, and then uh, we're going to broil these tomatoes in that bacon fat. A uh, little bit of salt and pepper. I'm going to put uh, a little bit of garlic. Just a little bit of garlic. Okay, and uh, so while that bacon's cooking, we'll be back in about three minutes. Back in the ranch here, we're gonna do some of the sauce for the uh, for the uh, hot brown, Kentucky hot brown. It's a hotel in uh, I don't know Louisville. Uh, I did a keto one with Carl Franklin one time. And, uh, A nice bacon sizzling. Got my toast browned on one side. Flash that back when we're ready. So you make any kind of cheese sauce you want, but I'm kind of doing this with uh, uh, no flour. Justin, one more favor, please. Some of that American. Thank you. I thought I brought some American. So a nice slice of uh, some cheddar. Put some Parmesan. nicely thank you Justin and a little bit of good old American Um, 
put that on a put that on a list. Get this pilot light fixed. So uh, we're gonna speed it up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a little bacon grease. I'm gonna cook our tomatoes in the bacon grease. Nice turkey. A nice piece of turkey. Stock going back here. Wait, it's not one knot. Yeah. Every little bit of flavor helps. Okay, so that's the hot brown. Make sure the bread is covered so that we don't burn those ends of bread when we glaze it. You gonna get your weapons ready? Up under the broiler, get it nice and golden brown. You know, kind of slow broil it. So that, you know, everything has time to cook real good. We'll be back in two minutes. My fork here, B. That's yours. You're not, you're not trying it? I am. Oh, I am out of here. <laughs> you got, you got it in your pocket? Hard though with 
that bacon on there. <laughs> the piece de resistance. Oh. All right. Where? Kentucky hot brown. I think it's the. I gotta. We gotta look. But in the descriptive line, like. All right. I think it's the hotel. Maybe the Brown Hotel in uh, Kentucky, Louisville. There you go. Careful. This this is maybe one that we need to show some restraint. Cheap stuff. Uh, what's that cheap cheap bacon they have? Uh, Smithfield. It's usually the one you get for like two for three dollars. <laughs> right? Yeah. Sometimes you get it on sale like two for three dollars. <laughs> yeah, that's really good. I don't know who invented this recipe, but I'm pretty serious. I'll tell you that. Yeah. So buy the best bacon you can. What the hell? <laughs> Be buy the best bacon you can. Best turkey you can. Mm. So this is like kind of like a cheese dream, like my mother used to make. That's all the ingredients: cheese, tomatoes, bacon. Tell you what, good old American cheese coming through <laughs> loud and clear. Dad Jack's good with the blues, so we're gonna find out who uh, asked me to do that uh, the recipe. Thank you for the suggestion, and uh, man, it's delicious. Really, uh, I'm gonna make a point of going to Kentucky and having it right from the source to see how mine matches up. Uh, Maybe it didn't call for garlic, maybe it didn't call for American cheese, but you know what? A okay. This is Daddy Jazz going to lose. Blues, Glenn Pelt here on camera, and uh, couldn't do it without you. Uh, New London deep water pork, Orsini sausages, you know, for Paula, we should be here to try this. Yeah. But um, hot sausage, links, coming up with the holidays, hot sausage and your Thanksgiving stuffing, uh, Christmas time. You know, the Italian traditions. Uh, God bless. Peace.